Hey you guys, so I wanted to come on here and talk about the Jesse Smollett situation and how it's been a couple of days and they still haven't came up with any evidence of his attack. Um, you know, has it been the summertime or the fall or any other time, the negative degrees weather, this would have made a little bit more sense. But, you know, things are just not adding up and I don't care how hungry I am, okay? I mean, I'm going to find some crackers or something in my house because I just don't see me going outside in negative degrees to get a sandwich, especially by myself, whether I'm a celebrity or not. Um, and the other thing that, one thing that's really not end up, or another thing that's not end up, is the fact that the neighbor saw some suspicious rednecks in the neighborhood and also saw them with something in their hand. I think it was a noose. But she said they were suspicious and didn't call the police. Now, had it been the other way around and white people saw some suspicious people in the neighborhood, they would have called the police. So that doesn't add up to me. And, you know, he's a grown man. So if he's out doing drugs or some freaky stuff, that's on him. But I think what is rubbing a lot of people the wrong way is the fact that you're making, it, it seems like you're race baiting. And that wouldn't be okay. You know, I believe you could have went to the hospital and just told them nothing. Told them you was attacked or told them that you was in a situation and you don't want to talk about it. They can't make you. But to go to the extreme and just make it sound like something else happened. It's just, it sounds like something out of a movie. And you know, people trip me out just because someone is a celebrity or looks like they have it together on the outside does not mean they have it together on the inside. So, again, the fact that there's no evidence and the fact that he got in a fight with two guys and the only thing he got is that little scratch on his face. <laughs> I mean, it's not enough. But I just wanted to come over here and get my thoughts about that. You guys can let me know of your opinion of the fact that there still has been no evidence of this alleged hate crime. Okay, I'm out.